Hello everyone, I just walked into the kitchen and turns out we've discovered the enemy base, so we can only hope they're not misusing the power of the program. Really? And you think there's any hope of that when in the last three instances the poor Grand Star was being terribly abused? Ah, overly optimistic Lumas. Poor creatures. Always have rose-colored glasses on. All right, so that was the new galaxy, it turns out. Um, I was thinking it was going to be this one, which now I actually can't quite remember what it is. But that's not open yet, so it's time to go to the the final galaxy in the dome, which is, of course, the Bowser one. So here it is. Bowser Jr.'s airship armada. This one is a lot more fun than the last Bowser Jr. one with that, that rather easy giant robot. This one's a lot longer. The boss fight is pretty cool. We gotta sink some airships. It's definitely my favorite of the three Bowser Jr. missions in this game. So, um, we got a lot of different, a lot of different obstacles. You saw a Mandy bug there. I actually forgot that those were in this galaxy as well. So, we are traversing airships in this mission. They're all guarded by these various enemies. Yeah, this is a really cool mission. Also, who doesn't love the music here? I could stop and play it for you, but honestly, I'm really excited to just start this mission. Whoa! Okay. Well, I'm so excited that I jumped off the edge of the ship by accident. <laughs> I seem to always die right after I say something to the contrary. Right there, I had just commented on how much I enjoyed the mission and one area of enjoyment in this mission was not dying that's not what I meant oh <laughs> that's a shortcut I forgot about I believe if you, sh you can shoot right over there that's the final airship you can see because you have the Luma there who's gonna give you items for the boss fight but we'll go through the mission as you're supposed to of course you can kill yourself by shooting off into the stars but what you're supposed to do is shoot right at this pole here. If you miss, like I did right there, you want to grab that pole star before it's too late. Alright, we got laser robots. Gotta watch out for those guys. Now we got a Magic Koopa. Magic Koopas are pretty difficult enemies. They cast spells and they keep moving around. And that is really cool. They are burning up the place. I'm trying to get a close-up first person of that. Oh well. Anything back here? No. Okay. So you have all these mini airships. Next one. Oh, we're already at this one? Okay. Just gotta watch out for those bullet bills. Shoot right at the I think I hit it. Yep. Cool. Alright, this mission was a bit shorter than I recall. But there's, we're, not, we're not at the boss yet. Still have to not get killed by the Wigglers. And then we can go up here. Get some Star Bits. You get a coin back by shooting the lights there. That's a very helpful tip. Now we can talk to this toad. Stop shining a light in my face. That hurts my eyes. I'm finally here. Ah, I can finally rescue you because all you toads won't ever do anything yourself. So this screw actually activates the next part of the level, so you don't want to hit that just yet. 30 star bits? I'm not even close to that. So I can get more? Because the boss fight's actually not, you know, it's somewhat difficult. I'm not sure I'm going to do it on the first try if I don't have the life mushroom. 
Um, well, I guess I should have picked up more star bits. Oh, wait a minute. This is going to give me star bits. Yes. Okay. I forgot. This gives you star bits. And I'm still way too short. Oh, when I can kill these guys? Come on. There we go. Alright, that's enough star bits. Yeah, the lever to activate the next part's over there. Okay, just enough. Alright, now I, I think I'm gonna beat the boss the first try. But if I don't, it's okay. It's a, it's a fun boss fight. Try to save all of that. Don't get killed by the Mandy Bug. Alright, now this is really cool. You flick the lever, and now you're gonna get bombarded. It's a lot harder than that Battle Rock mission. So you got spiders in your way. Oh, spider hit me. And you're traveling pretty fast here. Oh, God. That one almost killed me, to be honest. And that did poorly timed jump did kill me. <laughs> oh, crap. I have no Starbits now. That means no life mushroom, right? Unless, how many do I get for killing these wigglers? It's not going to be enough, is it? Let's see. No. Not enough. Alright, well, I'll have enough if I die. Then, on my next attempt, I'll have enough starbits. Oh, I can get some starbits here. I think they're pretty generous with starbits. Oh, God. Alright, I need to get a coin. I do not want to go into this boss fight. There's only two health. Oh, good, there's coins right up there. So this is cool. Take the sling star up here. And Bowser Jr.'s looking a little more fierce this time. He's not going to run away like a little chicken. He's going to whoop me? He's not going to personally come over and whoop me. Shortcut team. Alright, here's the boss fight. Still got that magic Koopa down there. Alright. They don't really explain much. Yeah, I think the first time I did this, it took me a while to figure out what you have to do. You gotta chuck shells at him, which is pretty cool. There you go. Yeah, honestly, the design on this one is not that great, because it doesn't even really show you what it, what you're doing. Like, you're not even sure that's what you're supposed to be doing. Because you can't see damage actually getting inflicted on the ship. Alright. I believe you don't want to hold on to these shells too long because they will re -trumped. Ah! These bullet bills are annoying. Oh, that doesn't stun him for very long, does it? Alright, let's get a coin. Oh, you can get a bullet bill up here and get more coins. I don't think I've noticed that up there before. Ow! Yeah, that Magic Koopa spell actually sets you on fire. Alright. Whoa. Alright, now it gets harder. Because the ship narrows by turning around 90 degrees. Oh, and he shoots fireballs. Forgot about that. Alright, I kind of desperately need a coin. I think this might be the hardest boss fight yet. Oh, Goomba. Well, I can use that for a coin. I didn't get a coin over there. I don't know if I've ever beaten this without the life mushroom before. You gotta throw it and then quickly run out of the way of the fireball. It's down here. Oh, you can go back down here. Whoa, kinda bounced when I got that shell. This is actually really cool. I love the music too. Ah, fireball blocked it. Yeah, this I'm really loving this challenge. I'm not sure I'm gonna beat him. Was oh, that it? Okay. It's not crazy difficult. But it's certainly not a walk in the park. Got down to one one health there at one point. If you really want, you can walk the plank. 
I don't see why you'd have any reason to. I wonder if you could long jump over to that ship over there. Hmm. I wonder if that's a glitch. And you still got a magic Koopa down there. Hello. I'm gonna get out of here. Can you go in here? Oh, no, they block it off. Alright. Here we go. Fourth Grand Star. Cranked up the victory music there just a bit. Alright. What do we have? New galaxy. Cool. First galaxy in the bedroom. That's where we're going to be ad headed next. But not until we check out the new chapter in the storybook. It's got a lot of stuff to check out now. And that is the final dome on the lower level. And they just gave away the name of the next dome. It is the engine room. So. Got a lot of cool stuff to check out. Let's see. You can see the fourth dome is spinning right there. Haven't gone back to this uh, zoomed out view in a while. Now we have some more areas we can look at. That's cool. So, we got a new chapter in the storybook. Should we do that now or at the start of the next video? Hmm. Yeah, let's do it now. Oh, I'm surprised that it looks exactly the same as, I w as the last time I was in here. Alright, so where we last left off, the poor Luma was looking for her mommy. Or something like that. But they were just asteroids. I would have packed more jam. So she's surviving on jam, apparently. Bread, milk, and jam, and apricot flavored tea. Yeah, who needs more than that? And a stuffed bunny. Oh, how cute. I forgot to bring water. That's funny. That's not funny. You're going to dehydrate and die. So, Starbits will hydrate her instead of water, apparently. Strange universe. And then they giggle uncontrollably. You sure there are no strange substances in that Starbit liquid? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Don't do drugs, kids. Or, I should say, don't do Starbits. They almost fell out, so now we're joking about death by falling into the endless depths of space. And the Starbits tasted like honey. I don't even know what to say about that. Alright, I think that was the strangest chapter in the storybook. Let's get the hell out of there. And instead of uh, pondering that for too long... I'm pretty sure I like almost all of the galaxies in the bedroom. I don't remember which one's first. Um, but looks like we'll do one or two missions here, then this one's gonna open up. So, what is it? Actually, I remember... I remember at least two of, of them here. So let's see if one of the ones I'm remembering is what we're gonna get. Ah, yes! There we go, that was the one of the two I was thinking of. 
Gusty Garden Galaxy, most famous for what most people consider to be the best music in this game. So I'll certainly be playing that for you at the start of the next video. Um, and actually, other than that, it's not one of my favorite galaxies. But it is... It, it, all the missions here are fun. There's no bad missions. Um, so that will be the next video. Start the bedroom. Thanks for watching, everyone.